guys welcome back to the channel um bug and i are here at ollie's sitting in the car about to go in um we just figured we'd swing by here today and see what they got we hadn't been in here in at least a few weeks um so we're just gonna check them out and the thrift store is also in the same parking lot as well as dollar general so we might check out those two places i don't know it just depends it's 9 40 right now and my husband goes on lunch at 11. so depending on how long we take in here we might run by the thrift store and um see if they got any goodies because we'd like to be home to spend lunch with him but you know if we don't end up coming back home at 11 i'm sure he'll be you know he'll be okay with that um but anyway i'm gonna try to record in there but I don't know how awkward I'm going to look, so um, we'll just see how it goes. So, see you in a minute. You ready, Freddy? Mm -hmm. Ready to go on Ollie's? Yeah, we're trying to. Um, okay, let's go. Christmas books, buddy. Should we get cherry? Okay. Can you put it back in Probably one ninety nine like it says. That's peel off. Whoa. That does from mommy. And oh my gosh, here's those soups that I got at the dollar store. As you can see, not everything's a good deal here. Because these are a dollar at Dollar Tree. So I'm going to skip those. Oh, these look good. Oh, Daddy would like these. Should we get some of these for Daddy? It's also birthday. Okay, got about a year on it. See a date on them. There you go. Canned chicken, dollar ninety-nine. See guys, here's another example. These are a dollar at Walmart. So okay. I 
a bad brass on that. Hot honey infused with chilies. Daddy would like that, but I'm going to pay $4.99 for it. Mm -hmm. Spices and ink to like a bunch. Okay. Get some chopped onion. Don't open it, baby. Burger season. That sounds good. Chip will try that. Don't put it in your mouth. No! What else they got? They got roasted garlic and herb. Steak seasoning. Smoky ranchero. Try it. Yeah, these are a dollar. A dollar tree. That looks interesting. Garlic sea salt. Hmm. Oh man, I love sesame sticks. Stuff. Oh, look, baby, that's your favorite Kool Aid. Let's get a couple of these. So, uh, next year. That is a hippo. <laughs> it's a doggy toy. Oh, should we get these for Ozzy? Should we get them for Ozzy? We gotta find something for Carla now. You think so? Oh, this is that blue buffalo. Look at her. A few of these. I got a kind of doggy treats, huh?
the deodorant. Too many boys in the house here. I was thinking. Mama needs to buy some fluoride free toothpaste. Things to put in Wes's um, stocking. Stuck on windshield wipers, guys. Yeah, this cracks me up. Cause we're in Alabama. <laughs> we never use this stuff. Cause we never get snow. That's funny. Clear chalkboard. That's pretty cool. Clear finish. Three ninety nine. I don't know what I would use that for. Why do I feel like I want to get into that? I'm thinking. More people spray everywhere. I think I'm gonna get it. I don't know why, but I'm gonna get it. Oh, let me put this back here. Oh my gosh, I'm buggy getting full, buddy. Our buggy's getting full. Hurry. Lots of rope and twine. Down here. That's where the good stuff's at. Got bungee cords. A whole wall of tarps. Hi. You can see. Tons of different sizes. And then you got a bunch of gloves, safety vests. That would be good to put in your car for if you ever break down, have an emergency. You'll be visible. That's not, I'm afraid that's not going to be big enough. So large, extra large. Yeah, they're all the same size. But that's a good idea. They had my size out to get one. Oh, mama might need this for camping. Oh, not for $10. No, oh, ma'am. Ain't that cute, huh? <laughs> this is some. I Screwdriver socket set. Mama might need this. For some videos, make video one easier. Should I get it? Should Mama get it? For $5? Let's see. 
kind of fish and stuff. Got fishing lines. I want to get out. You want to get out? Are we still shopping? Oh, what's that Paw Patrol? I know you're getting bored, huh? You're getting bored. Anybody need any hand sanitizer? It looks like vodka. <laughs> it's a big basket. Some storage cubes. We need to organize some of those preps. I got them in different sizes. Alright, guys. Be sure to check out all these for your um, food savers. How you know you're in the south. <laughs> oh, that's really pretty. Lace glove mittens. Long lasting. Well, that's cool. So you put the hot hands in it. Well, that's freaking cool. So they have camo. They have orange. That would be so cool to take camping to keep your hands warm. Hmm. Orange or camo? I think I'll get camo. God, this is ridiculous. Go over here. Uh, Keep these rain boots high, buddy. Look. Malachi, look. Look at these. Look. What are those? Okay. They're donuts. Put that lid back on there, buddy. Put the lid on. Look, these have sharks on them. Look, bud. Those are sharks. Sharks. Boot socks. Those are. Don't feel itchy at all. Let's see what kind of material they are. All weather. Oh, they're cotton and acrylic, so you need to avoid cotton. You need like wool to hold the heat in. Cotton will just make you colder and more susceptible to hypothermia and stuff. So. Good dogs and water. Oh, and it's daddy size. Get that for daddy. While it's still hot. They got a zombie on it. Alright. Yeah. Why don't we get out of here, bug? Think we spent enough money? Hmm. You think we spent enough money? I think so. <laughs> you should have stopped, Mommy. Mommy said too much. Hundred and fifteen dollars. Oh Lord. <laughs> I just spent $115 in this place. Why didn't anybody stop me? $115. Alright. Sorry if you can hear the air. It's so hot as balls here in Alabama. So I gotta have it. I got my weapon out. Opening up this box. Um, sorry guys. I got a car mount here at Ollie's. And as you know, I've been needing one. I got you propped up on my wallet right now. Let's see if it works. 
Um, but anyway, so we got some good deals. Um, some really good deals. <laughs> $115. There and um, I wasn't planning on spending that much, so I'm debating on whether or not we should go to the thrift store because you want a cookie? It's a Nutri Grain bar, baby. Here, um, you got it? I got some Nutri Grain bars for a really good deal, they were 75% off. So, oh my god, why is there so many parts to this? <laughs> Might not be able to set this up right now. And it's supposed to be a magnetic one. I'm gonna wait on that. I'll have my husband put it in because I've got too many parts for me. Um, but anyway, I'm debating on whether or not to go to the thrift store because. I did spend so much money in there. What do you think, Pumpkin? Should we go to the thrift store? He says no. Well, he didn't say anything, so I'm going to take that as a no. Yeah. We, actually, we got to go in there. My husband wants to see if they have any dryers. So, you know, they sell dryers sometimes. Sometimes they're in good condition. Sometimes they're in questionable condition so I guess we are going by there but don't let me spend a lot of money pumpkin okay uh, I told him he said he let me spend too much money in here <laughs> and I, I was filming in there and I had a couple weird people looking at me like weird like, um, but it wasn't too bad I did get some clips I actually got a lot of clips um, so y'all be able to see that and they had some things that were a good deal some that weren't and so you'll see that in the videos too but anyway i guess we're headed next door to the thrift store so we'll be right back this was here last time I thought it was so pretty. I think mommy's going to get it this time. Sure. These are where I usually get, you know, bags for different things like traveling. You can put your, emer I'm going to do an emergency kit video here soon. And I use bags like this. I'm not a big fan of that print. But they're Clinique bags. That I put mine in. That's cute. See what the inside looks like. Let's see, it's only a dollar. It's actually cute. Let me get that one. I'm gonna keep digging. Doing fostering before. Doesn't look like a very good freezer. <laughs> Check thrift stores for like adult diapers and stuff. This actually might be, this might fit my boys. Guys, these are expensive retail. Actually, those might be too big. Those are adult medium.
I don't know what's so funny, but <sighs> that's hilarious. <laughs> Sometimes he just cracks himself up for no reason. It's so cute. But anyway, we're done in the thrift store, and believe it or not, I only spent $26, so I think that's a new record for me. They didn't have as much good stuff today, which it can be kind of hit or miss there, and today was a miss. We didn't find hardly anything. <laughs> what is so funny? He's a mess. Anyway, so, um. <laughs> okay, anyway. We're gonna leave here and head back home, and then I'll show you what we got. And it's raining now. So, I'm going to have to unload all this stuff in the rain. That kind of stinks, but oh well. Anyway, uh, see you in a minute, guys. You hiding from the camera? Tell them what you're eating. Tell them what you're eating. You tell them? I'm gonna. Here, I'll show them. Cheese toast! Cut the triangles. Ow. Bite. Mmm. Cheese toast! Mmm. Smell it. Mmm. So, we're gonna eat our lunch because we got hungry, huh? I know. You were hungry. I know. Yep, go eat lunch. I'm hungry. You were hungry. <laughs> Eating some Progresso oh, chicken pot pie soup with dumplings. Mm. Yum, yum, yums. And he's eating cheese toast. Which mommy's got some in the toast drum, and I just had to get it to get it. Mmm, mmm, good. Say it. Mmm, mmm, good. Mmm, mmm, good. Yum, yum, yum. Alright, guys. So, we're back home. We vape lunch. All that good stuff. So, you saw us shopping for everything. I'm just going to quickly go through what we got. And, um, just so that this video is not that long. Um, anyway, so I'm going to start over here. We got some more detergent. This dollar detergent. We liked it pretty good. It's not as good as quality as Dawn. But, it's still pretty good. For the price, it works pretty well. And, we got... Four deodorants. They were they were super cheap, so I got four of them. They were sixty nine cents a piece. So I got four of those. Y'all saw me get this um, phone mount, and I figured out why it's marked down because it's missing a piece, which I might can rig it up. That little phone case looking thing right here, it's missing that. So I think I have another phone case that I can maybe rig it up to. We'll see. But anyway, so got that. Got the chalkboard paint. Still don't know what I'm going to do with it. But it was really neat. This is heavy. Um, it just puts a clear finish over whatever you paint it on. And it turns into chalkboards. And you can walk, you know, write on it with chalk. Can y'all tell my husband sits here every day uh, drawing and coloring? <laughs> well, that sounds like he's in kindergarten. <laughs> he's very artsy and he likes to draw and um anyway so he sits here at this part of the table every night that's why this is all rubbed off but anyway i got two more of the irish springs this is actually a different scent this is kind of like a lavender smelling scent i don't know it's not really lavender but that's what it smells like to me got two toothbrushes got some suet packs um I need to find, I have one hanging off my front porch, the little cages that they used to go in. I need to find my other one. But, um, 
Yeah. So I got peanut and raisin nut. And then can't forget our, our pets. So I got two of these. These are 69 cents a piece. And they're sectioned off. So you can like you don't have to open both at one time. So this is like divided. Um every Saturday we give our um our cat some wet food and um just as a treat we call it catter day i got that idea from some people i've watched for a really long time that are youtubers here in alabama not too not too far from me as a matter of fact um but anyway they do that with their cats too on, on catter day they give special treats to them but so this one's savory chicken and this one real turkey um yeah, turkey and duck pate. Sorry. Um, got some treats for the dog. These are smoked chicken flavor meatballs. Also, a thing I was thinking about. Now, we don't have rats right, or mice right now. But, I wanted to go ahead and start stocking up on like some pest control type things. Because, like here recently, we've had, we call them palmetto bugs. I don't know if that's just a country term, if that's the real term for them. But they look like giant cockroaches. And they're really gross and um, we've had to just try to eradicate them as much as possible and we've not seen as many but they they come out when it rains a lot and so it got me thinking what other kind of pest control things do we need to get and this was one of them now since we've gotten Carla we haven't noticed any frogs around any mice or anything and so I think she's keeping them at bay. I think she's just kind of scared them away. I know a lot of people are against outside cats for the fact that um, they can, you know, kill harmless creatures and stuff out there. But she's pretty good. She stays around the, the garage, and I think she just mainly just scares them off. Now, when she was a kitten, that's when, that's when she killed off a couple of frogs. But, um... But anyway, I think she's just keeping everything at bay. So, she's coming real handy for that. Um, but anyway, so I got two of those just to put back in case we ever do need them. And that way we don't have to run out to the store and get them if we a mouse shows up in the house or anything. Um, I got a couple of spices. This Flavor Mate Grillers. These were 99 cents a piece. Got roasted garlic and herb. And hamburger seasoning steak seasoning and also got some honey i'm not a honey fan but my husband is and honey's there's a lot of good qualities to honey a lot of medicinal things you can do with honey we don't have any so i got that mainly for my husband i got two things of chopped onions i like these these are um uh they rehydrate very well and then i got so these smoky ranchero marinade mixes now. I've never tried these before, but it sounded super good. I got a garlic and pepper seasoning, and I think I squished the stuff, I squished it in the buggy, so that was my bad. Whoops. Okay, and we got. Now I couldn't find a date on these, like anywhere. Um. So I only got two. I didn't want to buy a bunch if they had like a short date. So I got two of those. And got these Zatarans, mango, habanero, um, whole grain rice, and quinoa mix with spices. That sounded super delicious. Now my husband is the habanero fan. So I got those for him. Goat. Got those for him. Um We've had this flavor before, and it was really, really, really good. So, got two of those of the Salsa Verde. And I love couscous. So, um, got some of that. Now, I've not had the pearled couscous. I've had, like, the smaller ones. But, I mean, they're all yummy in my opinion. So, got those. And then I got two of the Ready Rice Basmati's. Uh, Basmati Rice for $1.29. And got uh, two rice pilafs. And then they had the pasta sides. They had cheddar broccoli. These were 89 cents a piece. I got two cheddar broccolis. Two chicken flavor. Two Spanish rice. Now these don't need much explanation. Because all y'all buy those. I know you do. <laughs> so 
I got, um, I needed some snacks for the kids for school. So I got some lemon cookies and some of these toasted peanut butter crackers. And I got two of these cheese crispers, um, Ritz crackers. And they were $1.79 a piece. Those are really yummy too. And then back here, I didn't really need much cereal because we, we're still pretty good, um, pretty well stocked up from the last time I went to Ollie's, but these were only 99 cents. And I can throw some of these in um, a couple snack bags and send them for snacks um, to school. And so, um, yeah, I'm not a big fan of Captain Crunch. It just tears up my mouth. I don't know what it is about it, but it's terrible. But my kids love it. So I got two boxes of those. And then, y'all remember from my last Ollie's haul, I had bought these grits. And this one was marked down today. This was the only one they had. And I think we've pretty much eaten all the other ones that I bought. I think I have one box left. But they were $1.29, but they were 75% off. So I'm not exactly sure what it rang up as. Um... And then got some cherry pop tarts and strawberry, and these are my favorite, the oh, the pret cinnamon sugar pretzel ones. I love these; they're super good. Okay, and it's got all those. It's got some Chips Ahoy cookies. Got some Fruit Loop cereal bars, Frosted Flake cereal bars, and these were seventy five percent off too. I got. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six boxes. We opened this one and had a little snack before we went in the thrift store. But these ended up being like 32 cents a box. So I was really excited about that. Um, so yeah, shop. When you go in stores, always hit up the clearance section. Because even if it goes out of date, like this one out of date, September 10th. Okay, now that was like a week ago. And they're still good. I had one earlier and they were delicious. So those won't last long in my house. Especially having three boys and a husband. They'll be gone in no time. So always check your clearance sections. And even if something's short dated or already out of date. Just eat it first before you eat the other stuff. And it'll, you can save a ton of money doing it that way. This Kool-Aid. Now I know it seems like I buy a lot of Kool-Aid. But my kids don't just drink straight Kool-Aid. A lot of this is just going into storage that we're not going to drink now. This flavor is my kids' favorite. Um, the strawberry, or, sorry, charcoalberry fan. It's really good. Um, I don't even know. Now that I think about it, I don't even know what flavors it's supposed to be. I think it's like strawberry. Oh, well, duh. There's the picture right there. Orange, banana, and strawberry. It seems like. So, I get these to put up, and we don't drink these all at one time. My kids drink mainly juice and water. And when I say they drink juice, I mean they drink three quarters water and a little bit of juice just to give it flavor, or they won't drink water. So, um, like I said, this is going into storage, and we'll pull it out whenever we decide to make some. And even when I give them Kool-Aid, it's mainly water, and it's just a little bit of Kool-Aid flavor. Just to give it flavor. Um, but anyway, I don't have to justify myself. You know? I'm just explaining because it does look like I, you know, pump the kids full of sugar. But everything in moderation. You know, my kids are autistic and they can't, they don't deal well with a lot of sugar. So, we try to um, limit that as much as possible. So, anyway, that's everything that I got from Ollie's and... I don't have really enough to do a thrift store haul. So right after I put this stuff up, I'll just come back and show you what I got at the thrift store, okay? So I'll see y'all in a minute. All right, guys, I lied. This, uh, this is still the Ollie's haul. I uh, found another bag that had the most important stuff in it that I was excited about. I don't know how I forgot it. But anyway, so I got my husband this tank top. It says Walking Dead Survivor. He's a big Walking Dead fan. And it's hard to find, he wears a 3X. It's hard to find clothes sometimes for him. So I was excited to find that. And it was real cheap, $3.99. So I thought that was a good deal. Another thing I was excited about were these. These are fleece gloves slash mittens. 
and they have a pocket in them where you put the hot hands. So this would be great for camping, hunting, just being outdoors in general. Um, they're fleece and super warm. They had bright orange and they had camo. I got the camo. Um, but I thought that was a really good deal too. It was ten dollars, and I mean, it it says it comes with some hot hands in it. Yeah, it comes with a pair of warmers. I don't know where they are. I guess they're tucked in there somewhere. But anyway, yeah, I was excited about that. Another camping thing I got that I was excited about was this. This para hatchet. So it's got paracord around the um, around the handle. It comes with a fire steel. It comes with like the um, built-in wrenches, the hex wrench, and it's got the cord cutter stainless steel blade and it has the sheath that it goes in so how cool is that 10 bucks so i'll definitely take that camping with us um and also speaking of camping i'm going to um be making some fire starters here soon so i got these cotton rounds to make those out of and then cotton balls so i'm going to put petroleum jelly on these and put them in a bag and i'm going to welt welt melt some wax and make um, fire starters out of these. Now I probably will only use one pack, but I'll have one for to put away for next time. And then um, I got these two drain snakes. Now they're made of plastic, so they're not gonna be like super heavy duty, but they were 99 cents. So I have a clog starting to form in my shower upstairs. So I need one anyway, and so I got another one for backup. Be sure you're stocking up on this type of stuff because you don't realize how bad you need something until you don't have it. And when your shower stopped up and you've got water leaking everywhere and it's flooding your bathroom, that's, that's going to be a problem. So be sure you're keeping these on hand. And I kept looking for these at Dollar Tree because I, I saw people hauling them. And I can ne they never have them at, at either one of my Dollar Trees. So check out Ollie's if you've got one near you. And go grab you one because most of the Ollie stores get around about the same things. Depends on what region you are. I'm in Alabama, so um, there's a ton of stores within my region, and they're all getting around about the same stuff. So go check them out. And um, yes, yeah, so that's the rest of the Ollie's haul, and now I'll show you the thrift store stuff. Alright guys, so my feet are killing me, so I'm just going to do this sitting down. Um, like I said, I didn't get a whole lot there. I only spent $26, and $10 of that was on one item, which I'll show you in a second. Um, but the first item I got was this sheet set. It's a microfiber um, sheet set, and it's $5. Now, right now, I bought a twin-size air mattress to take camping, but... I plan on getting a better full-size one that these can go on plus um, we're wanting to get a full-size bed for my oldest son and um, you can never have too many sheet sets and it's brand new everything's in it and it was five bucks so you know I couldn't turn that one down and this right here is a shower curtain if you can tell how pretty it is it's got beautiful colors. It was $4. This was there last time I went and I almost got it then. And I told myself, um, cause I, I was spending so much money last time. Um, I told myself if it's still there next time I go, I'll get it. And so it was there. And so I got it. And I don't know why it was still there because it's beautiful. And, um, so that'll go in our downstairs bathroom. And then, um, I'm making some, uh, car I know y'all tired of hearing me say this, and I'm gonna do the video soon. I'm still buying, getting the stuff all together to go in it. I'm making car essentials emergency kits for my best friend, um, my future sister-in-law. She'll be my sister-in-law next month. So, yay. And, um. And I'm probably going to redo mine because I'm missing all kind of stuff out of mine. I've used it so much. That's how beneficial these car kits are. And so, 
I use these type of bags. These are like makeup bags. They are, this one's got cherries on it. So it's super cute. They're only a dollar a piece. So I got two of this color. Now I got multiple bags. Um, I already have one bag I'm gonna put my best friends in. And I was looking for one more for my sister-in-law. Um, but they had matching ones that were super cute. And so I went ahead and got them because I'll probably, this is like one of my favorite gifts to give people. Um, I'll probably, I'll probably make some more in the future. So, um, that's why I went ahead and grabbed them. I might make one for my cousin. Um, but anyway, so this is the other two. Super cute. The colors aren't showing up as vibrant on the camera, but I really like them. Um, and this one's a little bit bigger than the other ones, and I might, I don't know why I liked this one so much, it's real plain. I might transfer my kit into this, because the one I have is this size, so it's a little bit bigger. Yeah, put it back, baby. So anyway, I got those, and all those were a dollar a piece. Thank you, baby. Thank you. All right, and the next thing I got was um, this wrapping paper. And I don't know if you're going to be able to tell what it says, but it says, like, cutie, baby, um, cutie pie, we want. It's, like, all kind of different sayings. I have a nephew due in January, and so I'm probably going to wrap his some of his gifts in that. Put it down, baby. Hang on, guys. All right, guys. So, yeah, I'm going to wrap all his um, gifts in that. And then I need more Christmas wrapping paper. Like, I need a hole in the head. I, I'm kind of a wrapping paper addict. But when they're so cute, I have to buy them. And I'm a sucker for Snoopy. And so I had to give this, get this. Look how cute that is. Got Snoopy and Woodstock. They're just, it's just super cute. And these were only a dollar a piece. So, I had to give them, and funny thing is, I have a roll of Snoopy wrapping paper up there, but it's different. <laughs> but anyway, let's see what else I got. I think this, this is the last thing I got, and it's the last thing I saw on the way to the register, so I had to give it, get it. So, all you ladies are, that are familiar with Lily Bloom, you know their purses can be pretty high. But, um, this was $10.00. And I'm not sure how much this one retails for, but I looked at one one time, and oh my god, it was like $50. It was ridiculous, and it was like a, a crossbody bag. It was small, but this was only $10. It's got my favorite color on the inside. It's got multiple pockets. I'm not a big purse carrier. Um, the last few purses I've had have been really small. And um, I always feel like I need all my hands having the boys because um, I have to hold all their hands when we go somewhere. If I'm by myself with them, um, it's harder. When I have my husband, obviously, it's a lot easier. But um, uh, I was using, oh, I'm still kind of using it, but I'm wanting to change up the system. I have a backpack that we use as a diaper bag that we carry their um, diapers and wipes and stuff like that in. But... I'm tired of carrying around that backpack. So I'm gonna start carrying my purses again. And I'm gonna put pull ups, like maybe one or two pull ups, a diaper, and some wipes in here, and be good to go. And if I need anything, I'll just go to the car and get it. So, but yeah, this is super cute. And I just love the design on it. And it's real bright. I love color. I don't like white and black. And that's just boring to me. Like, I like this kind of stuff. And I like the leather on it and stuff. So, anyway, that's everything I got at the thrift store. Like I said, um, I didn't spend a whole lot of money. Which I usually spend a lot more than that at the thrift store. But I kind of avoided some of the um, aisles. I briefly looked through the women's clothes. But anything that's my size, and no offense to mamas out there. But everything in my size is always mama style. They're always 
like velvet or got a bunch of flowers all over it or just gold and gaudy with shoulder pads and um it's just not my style so i didn't look out today at the thrift store which is fun but anyway this video is gonna be long enough i'm gonna try next time to not make it so long but some of y'all might like longer videos i don't know i know i love longer vi i love watching long videos but anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope I didn't bore y'all too too much. I'm still new to the vlogging and public thing, so if it looks like crap, don't come for me. You know, it's kind of just a hobby for myself anyway. So just be nice. If it's not that good, then, you know, better luck next time. But anyway, um, I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye.